my channel. My name is Savannah from the channel Savannah and Stuff. But if you are an old subscriber, I'm just gonna give a little bit of a speech here as to why I haven't posted in three weeks, which is incredibly rare for me. Alright, so today's video is a clothing haul and I have not done a clothing haul in a long time. Alright, so give this video a thumbs up if you have a thumb and let's get into it. So anyways, you guys, I went spring shopping at the Dixie Outlet Mall, which is about 20 minutes away from downtown Toronto. So they provided me with a gift card to do some shopping there and to show you guys some different items and some different stores. So huge shout out to Dixie Mall for providing me with this opportunity because I have seriously picked out so many items that I love and I've been wearing pretty much every single day. So I'm going to have their links and their social medias down below in case you guys want to check it out. So I actually have vlog footage of this trip because I went with my mom. We did some shopping. Hey guys, what's up? I am here with my mother and we are just heading out to the Dixie Mall. We're very excited. We're going to have a full day of shopping, you know, girls day. I think I'm going to look for a pair of shoes. So we have finally arrived at the mall. It looks like a good time. Have you seen any stores you're interested in? Oh, this lighting is good. Look at this There's lots here. There's too many. There's too many to choose from. I feel like there's a great combination of stores that are geared towards a younger demographic. Then there's also a lot of great stores for an older oh, demographic. Like myself. There's even a flea market here. Yeah, there's a flea market, which is pretty dope. Yeah, let's go shopping. I just want to reiterate the deals at that mall. They have a lot of brand name stores that are outlets. You can get stuff for very, very cheap prices. There's one store in particular that has shockingly crazy prices. They have racks of brand new clothing for $2. Literally $2. You you found your spot, didn't you? I found my spot. You found your spot. You guys, everything on this rack is $2. That is pretty insane. And it's all new stuff too. So I'm pretty sure that it's just stuff that came from stores that maybe they haven't sold or are just kind of out of season or over stocked or something like that so it's pretty crazy you guys there's lots of really good deals here everything is so cheap i saw so many brand new gap jeans for ten dollars which is crazy so i'm gonna start off with my favorite store in the dixie mall which is guess so that was honestly the first time that i shopped at guess because guess is a little bit more expensive and your girl is more dollarama you know but the first thing that i received is this jacket and i liked it so much that i got it in two colors the first one is green it definitely fits like a glove i wish that they had more colors and then I also got it in light pink because I feel like it's a really good color for spring. I purchased mine in an extra small just because I actually do really like things that are fitted. I don't know. It makes me feel more confident. I'm into it. But these jackets were $89.99 and I would say that Guess is probably the one store in the mall that doesn't really have discounts. Funny how I'm starting off with them. But honestly, it's great quality. It makes me feel confident and I think that it's worth spending money on that. And then next from Guess, I got a very trendy piece. So it's just a pair of jeans that have a floral design on it, which I feel like is a big trend for spring this year. And then they got the flowers on the butt, cause you know, you always need flowers on the butt. And these jeans were $59.99. The next store I went to was Sirens, and don't you just love the sound of that bag? I know that that can kinda sound really bad on camera, so I'm just gonna put it down. I purchased two tops for $14.99 each, which is an amazing price. And you guys, they're the same top in two different colors, so similar to the jacket. And if you guys follow me on social media, you would have definitely seen this. I've been wearing this top every single chance I can get. I've been loving tops recently that have the built-in choker. So yeah, this is what it looks like. And honestly, it's a really good quality and it was only $15. And then I got the same top in a dark blue. It's definitely coming up as black on camera, but this is a really lovely top as well. I feel like tops like this are perfect for when you're going out with your girlfriends, going out for a few drinks, but you don't want to wear a dress. You know, you want to be a little bit more casual. Next, I went to Boathouse, which definitely used to be one of my favorite stores in high school. They had all those cool brands like Roxy and Billabong. I literally just forgot about Billabong. But anyways, you guys, I ended up getting this velvet dress. Right when I tried it on, I knew I wanted to get it. I know it's not so much spring, but I thought that it was very flattering on and it was really, really cheap. You guys, this dress was straight up $9.97 and then with taxes, it was $11.27. That's just flipping insane. Today's post notification shout out goes to Kayla and she says, I subscribed and turned on the bell. Well, thank you so much, girl. You the best. If you guys want to shout out in the next video, all you have to do is turn on post notifications, tap that bell, and let me know that you've done so in the comments. And for my next item, there is a store that is a cross between Dynamite and Garage, and their sales were just crazy, you guys. Tons of items for $5. It's kind of madness. 
By the way, I've already worn a lot of these things, so if it doesn't look great on camera, that's kind of why. I don't know. Right when I get clothes I like, I want to wear them like every single day. So this top, I believe, was originally $30, and with taxes, I got it for $16.95, so that's about half off. But this top just makes you feel really confident, and I wanted to get it in other colors, but they didn't have any. So next, I went to a store called Famous Footwear, and I was looking for some everyday sneakers that I could wear that are actually comfortable, because I kind of have some issues with my feet, and I can't be wearing stuff that's super uncomfortable, or else I'm gonna die. Well, I will die one day, but not from shoes, I hope. So here are the shoes. They are both from Roxy. Both of these came to $54.99, and I got them in a size 8, which is actually surprising because I'm normally size 7, but I think these fit a little bit small. But anyways, you guys, I tried them on, and they were super, super comfortable, and that made me decide to get them in two colors. I've seen a pattern here with my shopping, and I have never been like that in the past. I've always gotten a bunch of random stuff for the sake of variety, but again, what I'm realizing is some pieces make you feel confident, you like them, why would you wear anything else? I feel like $54 is a really good price for sneakers that go with everything and that are also really comfortable. The soles on these shoes are very squishy, so it just kind of gives you some more support. And they also had a bunch of other colors there and different kind of patterns and designs as well. So if you don't like those ones, I would highly suggest checking out some other ones because those shoes are comfortable. <laughs> Next we have a different item and it is from West 49. Can you guys guess what's inside? Is it candy? <laughs> no, it's not. It's a hat. All right, so I was looking for a white hat and I walked into West 49 and I saw this. It saw me and that's just history. And I got this hat for $14.64. Next I went to Levi's, which I discovered is another one of my favorite favorite stores. They have some really good deals on jeans. They pretty much have all the jeans that you would get in the regular Levi's store, but this one is the outlet, so you get a discount in price. So for example, the jeans that I got were originally $84.95, but I got them for $64.99, so that's about a $20 savings. The worker there was super, super friendly. She looked at my body type, and she was like, this is the type that will look good on you. So I followed her advice, I tried on the jeans, and I absolutely loved them. So again, I've already worn all these jeans, so they're going to be really, you know, not looking the cutest. But this is the first pair you guys and I got the shaping skinny. So I would say that my body type is a little bit more curvier. I'm not super skinny. But I definitely have hips. So some things that I wear I find can make me look bigger. And then other things I wear I feel like can be very flattering. And I feel like these jeans look great. I really like the way that it makes my butt look. It's kind of like a butt lift. So if you feel like you kind of have a similar body type to me I would definitely recommend these. And they're also a little bit high waisted so they're great to wear with tops that are a little bit shorter. You guys, I am seriously gonna go back and I'm gonna buy probably two other pairs. And then I also bought them in black because I feel like having a pair of black jeans are such a staple. It goes with literally everything. So on average, I'm about a size 28 and these jeans do stretch a bit, so she recommended me going with the size 27. And honestly, you guys, I probably could have even went with the 26. Right when I put them on, they probably would have been crazy tight, but they would have stretched out. I've also been working out a lot lately, so maybe I actually have kind of changed my waist diameter. I don't know. But anyways, I cannot recommend these jeans enough. They're amazing. And then I got a pair of shorts just because, you know, it's getting warmer out. I know eventually it will be super warm, so I thought, why not? And I got mine in the Levi's Original Fit 501, and the size of these is 28. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I actually don't really buy shorts a lot. I don't really wear shorts a lot. And I think a lot of girls are like that as well. Honestly, sometimes I don't really feel the most confident in my legs. I feel like when I sit down, there's just a lot of thigh happening, but I know that a lot of you guys can relate because I've talked to friends about this. I feel the exact same way, but at this point I'm like, screw it. I'm gonna do me, I'm gonna wear my shorts, and you guys will see me in a picture on Instagram someday in those shorts. Alright you guys, so if I'm being honest, I just kind of took some time away from social media and YouTube because I was just truthfully trying to figure out what makes me happy in life and I was trying to have a more well-rounded picture. I didn't want to just be work all the time because I don't think that that's very satisfying. So anyways, for the last few weeks, I've been focusing heavily on friendships as well as hobbies. So I'm just trying to build kind of like an optimal life for myself and I'm the type of person who gets a lot of happiness from relationships I have as well as doing things that are outside of my comfort zone and essentially just living and I don't want to be living on a screen because the truth is we're all gonna die one day and I don't know I seriously just want to have an awesome life and I want to do more and that's what I've been doing for the last three weeks and I've got to say I've honestly been really happy and I've been really enjoying the way that my life is kind of going right now I made a post talking about this stuff on Instagram so if you're interested in seeing that my Instagram is at Savin stuff my snapchats at Savin stuff musically all of those different things but I posted 
a ton on Snapchat. I'm always vlogging my life, so if you want to see what my life is like, I would definitely check it out, and I have a lot of fun over there. All right, you guys, let me know in the comments down below which items were your favorites. Let me know. I want to hear from you. Do not forget to go and check out the Dixie Mall, you guys, because they have a ton of savings. It's honestly insane. There is so many great stores there. Do not forget to subscribe if you watch this full video and you haven't yet. And yeah, you guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye!